Hello and welcome to Invisent News. You are watching English Bulletin with me, Ratnakar. The news in detail. Cracking a whip against flourishing incident of house breaking and burglary in rural Nagpur, the local crime branch of Nagpur Rural Police here on Friday arrested four members of gang involved in six cases of house breaking theft under Mauda, Kandeshwar, Haroli and Kanan Police Station. Murder was rupees 1.83 lakhs comprising gold and silver armaments besides electronic gadgets and other material were also confiscated from them. The name of the accused were given as Tarun alias Tupan Ashok Meshram, a resident of a railway crossing Kanan Road, Kamthi. Vikran alias Golu Vijay Meshram, a resident of Selam Nagar, Kamthi. Riki alias Indo Raju Borkar, a resident of Kamgar Nagar, Kamthi. And Mohammed Mohan Farooq Alam, a resident of Azad Nagar, Kamthi. The action was planned under the supervision of SP Rakesh Ora, additional SP Rahul Mahnikar and PI Anil Jitta. It was during the tenure of Shirat Pawar as a union agriculture minister that India became self-reliant in food production. He brought a second green revolution while working in politics, social work, sports, cultural fields, disaster management. Pawar kept good relations with all. Remarked Home Minister Anil Deshmukh, he was speaking in a virtual rally organized by a National Congress Party activist Dr. Dr. Vasudharish Pandey Hall on Saturday to mark the birthday of Sharad Pawar. Pawar is one such a leader who has never witnessed defeat. He is not only respected at national level but also abroad too. He is worried over farmers' issues, especially of Vidarbha. Whenever crisis occurs, Pawar is known as leader who come to the rescue, explained Deshmukh. Ramesh Bang, ex-NLC, Prakash Bajbe, ex-MLA and others. The program was shown live on big screen. City police on Saturday evening got 10 self-balancing scooters to be used for patrolling in some part of the city. Anil Deshmukh, Home Minister, flagged off the first batch of cops riding these scooters. Deshmukh also rode a scooter. Amitesh Kumar, Commissioner of Police, welcomed the Home Minister at outset. Sunil Kulari, ACP Crime, Navin Chandradi, ACP South, Delhi Jalke, ACP North, Vijana Rajmane, DCP Detection, Nurul Hassan, DCP Zone 1 and other were present prominently. Speaking on the occasion, Minister Deshmukh said that the self-balancing scooter were launched for cops in Mumbai four months ago. As many as 50 such scooters are being used for patrolling there. Similarly, 10 self-balancing scooters have been made available to Nakpur City Police now. In future, the number will increase. All efforts are being made for modernization of City Police, he added. Union Minister for Road Transport and MSM Nitin Gurkhe on Saturday inaugurated the state-of-the-art Electraversa HT Linear Accelerator at the Rashtra Santatopoulos Regional Cancer Hospital and Research Center on the Manewaradi Road. On the occasion, the state's sports minister Sunil Keda, Nakhpur Division Commissioner Dr. Sanjeev Kumar and other dignitaries were present. At Rashtra Santatopoulos Regional Cancer Hospital, research is fully equipped with state-of-the-art medical equipment. Gurkhe suggested that the training course should be conducted here to which students from medicine and light disciplines would get employment and the center would also benefit. After much negotiation between the officials and stakeholders of the center, approval was given to install a sophisticated machine like linear accelerator in the center. Gadgari also said that the center would get more funding from the center and state government from time to time. Newly elected member of Legislative Council from the graduate constituency in Nagpur and Congressman Abhijit Vanjari tested positive for COVID-19 on Saturday. Vanjari told reporters, yes, I tested positive for COVID-19 today. I am symptomatic. I request all the people who have come in close contact with me to get themselves tested and take appropriate precautions. He added, once I am out of my quarantine period, I will surely get back to survive my people and my constituency. The Congress leader of late engineer and major upset in a local politics by decisively defeating BJP in allied parties candidate and mayor Sandeep Joshi in the recently concluded graduate constituency. On December 11, the second capital of the state registered 376 fresh cases. After today's high, the cumulative number has reached to 1,16,911, while seven people succumbed to the infection, taking the total count of fatality to 3,791. From the total deaths, 2,000 
586 deaths from the city, 659 from rural and the rest 547 from out of Nagpur, an official release said. After the fresh updates, the total active cases in the city now stands at 5970, including asymptomatic cases, advice for home isolation. Also, 379 persons became free of the infection in the day, taking the cumulative number of record cases to 1,7149, including 57,948 home isolation recoveries. As per latest data, recovery rate is 91.65%. Saturday, seven fatality cases, including one case from the city, three from outside the city, and three patients from rural areas of the district. Well, that's all from this bulletin. For more updates in Iran, the city is in tune with in this news. Till then, Ratnakar says goodbye. Please take very good care of yourself and family.